boy, what's wrong? My baby, Nico. A wave pulled him right off my back. Yow! Looks like the little nipper got caught in a rip current. But, but I thought pygmy sloths were strong swimmers. We carry our babies everywhere we go for more than a year. Nico isn't ready to swim on his own yet. Then we've got a pygmy sloth to rescue. Come on, Granddad. Sloth low! Hmm? Sounds like a tasty treat. Good news! Nico made it to the shore! <gasps> Bad news! There's a hungry jaguar on that shore! Hang on, Grandad! We need to save that shaggy sea. I, I mean, baby sloth! like a fish. or we'll bite every last one is. I'd like to see you try. A first, ye shark scallywags. Try chomping these tasty treats. Hey, that's the tastiest thing I ever chomped. Hey, you guys gotta try these things. They're amazing. We got them hooked. Let's go. All right, the sharks are gone for now. And I can take you to a spot up river where they won't bother you anymore. But this is our home. Give me one good reason why we should follow you. Ha! I'll give you two reasons. One, the water here is salty and it'll make you sick. I think he's right, Big Bro. I still don't feel good. And two, I got a whole bunch of these. Huh? Mm -mm. Now I'm starting to think that you might just be onto something, Ranger. Here you go. Eat up. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh, that's good. Here, have one of these, little bro. It'll make you feel better. Mm -hmm. oh, delicious. It's working. If we can keep this up, Ranger Marsh will have plenty of time to lead the alligators to safety. Uh, there's only one problem with that, me hearty. What? We're all out of fish biscuits. Then we'll just have to improvise. Ooh, what's that thing? I don't know, but it looks tasty. Look out, Pony! Here they come! Oh, I need to go faster. Oh. How? He can't outrun those sharks for long. I've got to do something. I can't go any faster. But maybe I can be smarter. Hey, where'd it go? <gasps> There's someone there! <gasps> oh, what? what? 
It's gone again! Oh, wait! Hey, it's behind us! Oh, 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 oh. Watch where you're going! Take the fin out of my face! Hey, look at me! Gotta keep going. But not through that. Ow! They didn't get me, but they got my Octowatch! That tasted terrible, but I bet you'll taste better. Thanks, Quasi. That was a splashing rescue. Keep them coming, you guys. Dinner. Ready, Tweak? Ready, Quasi. Now. Ship shape. Oh, look at this place. It's a mess. And I'm still hungry. I know you didn't mean to damage this ecosystem, Carl. But all that grass you ate was helping to hold the shoreline together. Now it's crumbling into the river. Oh, well, nothing I can do about it now. So I guess I'll just go where there's more food. Hooray! He's leaving! And good riddance. I'm afraid there's nothing good about it. Carl will just keep eating his way up the river and into the Great Lakes. Hey! I'm stuck here! Somebody give me a hand! Oh, maybe I shouldn't have eaten all that grass. Now do you see what you've done to this ecosystem, Carl? I guess I really did mess things up pretty bad around here. Well, matey, if you let us, we can help you. Carl, we know your home is in Asia. Would you like us to take you back there? There'll be just the right amount of food for you there. Right now, I'd rather be anywhere but here. OK, you've got a deal. There is still a problem, though. How do we get him out? Oh, maybe Periwinkle can lift him out, like before. Periwinkle? Now, where has he gone? Oh. Oh. <laughs> Good work, son. Thanks, Mom. You know, this is maybe the most fun vacation ever. Here you are, Carl. Welcome home. Oh, I don't know about this. I used to be a big fish in a little pond. What if I don't fit in here? Hey, check it out, a new guy. Bit scrawny, though, isn't he? <laughs> hey, where'd he go? Boom! Oh. <laughs> <laughs> nice. You're going to fit in here great. We can show you where there's lots of grass to eat. Come on. Yeah, come on in, mate. Wow, you're going to love it. <laughs> it sure is a spooky-looking night out there, Grandad. Hi, Quasi. A perfect night to be sailing the high seas in search of the legendary Mystery Island. Uh, Mystery Island? Uh, Mystery Island? According to pirate law, Mystery Island is like another world. Another world? You mean an island stranded in outer space where pirates go to dig up sparkly moon rocks? Oh, and I bet it's guarded by invisible aliens. The few poisonous red ooze that can melt anything in its path! <coughs> Not sure about that part, Quasi. <laughs> what is it, Pete? <laughs> Rogue Way! Hang on, mateys! When the wave goes high, we go low! Are you sure about this, Grandad? As sure as a pirate can be, Quasi. So, pretty sure. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh. Oh, you mateys all right? Yeah. Oh, another way! The windshield! Brace for impact! Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Where are we? Oh, you're awake. 
I usually prefer my meals a little less lively. Guess I'll just have to crack open this egg I found. Well, in all my years sailing the seven seas, I've never seen a bird use sticks and stones as tools before. Oh, that's nothing for an Egyptian vulture like me. Watch, I'll have this egg cracked open in no time. Uh, uh, maybe you'd like something tastier than an egg? <laughs> See, all it takes is the right tool. Wait, that's not my egg. Mmm, but it sure is tasty. Plenty more where that came from. We've got a whole stash on the gup R. Where is the gup R? That rogue wave must have washed her out to sea. You know what that means? No more yummy snacks for me. Worse, it means we're stranded. This place is full of strange alien trees and plants. Huh? And butterflies with eyes on their wings. Yow! And that tree's alive! They're just snails, Quasi. What if that rogue wave launched us clear into outer space and Mystery Island is actually on a whole other planet? Right now, the only mystery about this island is how we get off it. Aha! Now I just need something to write with and we can send out a message in a bottle for help. Come out, come out, wherever you are. Control this reef. I can't let them nab me. I better beat it. Good thinking, Shellington. The only thing that can scare a big fish is an even bigger fish. Well, yes, but technically, orcas are dolphins, which are mammals. There's a shark, sir. Should we nab him? Forget it. It's Coral Reef. We'll never find him in there. The current that carried me ashore was strong. But then I realized, if those baby eels got caught in it too, they had to be somewhere close by. Oh, I swear you were snappy you said that. I did. <gasps> baby eels! You're so transparent that you're practically invisible. No wonder no one saw you. Koshi, are you all right? Yes, and I've found the missing eels. Being transparent helps protect us from predators. Amazing! Your family has been very worried. We, we want, want to go, go home. home! I think we can help with that. You found them. Oh, how can we ever thank you? Just doing our jobs. Uh, how about a family picture? Everyone say seaweed! Seaweed! And that's how the Mystery Sisters and Shellington closed the book on the mystery of the missing eels. I'm Captain Barnacles. I'm Matey. Come on, everyone join in. Right, let's go. <laughs> 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 